Good morning, guys. It is your girl T from God Will Deliver Ministries. How is everyone today? Um, today's title is Gonna Entail. The narcissist is talking about you. So let's do it. So, Father God, in the name of Jesus, God, we just thank you for um, forgiving our sins, our trespasses, and our um, shortcomings, God. We ask that you allow us to have a repentant heart, to seek ye first, God, in everything that we do. We thank you for just loving us in spite of. We thank you. We honor you in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay. So, guys, the narcissist is talking about you. And let me tell you why. Because you fly. You are beautiful. So especially to those who have um, or was dating an older narcissist, they're getting older. So they have to use you um, to sh basically show the other person like, yeah, this is what I get. Um, this is what I catch. This is this is the type of person that I mess with. Okay. Um, so... And then, and I don't know why I'm not like this. So I'm not speaking about me. I don't look at what somebody else got have and want it. If you with somebody, you with somebody. Because the truth of the matter is, the very thing that you're doing to them, you would do to me. But you have some females, guys, uh, women and men, and this go for the men too, who some women looked at us and some men looked at the female and thought how he get her oh he gotta be a good catch oh she fly oh look how she dress look what she driving oh look and equated that the narcissist did that so then you have these people that begin to want what they think the narcissist done for us when the truth of the matter is, we came all together. We came fly. We came beautiful. We came with stuff. But you have those Jezebel spirits that look at us and equate that the narcissist did this. So when we leave, guys, that's why it's so important that when you leave, you stay fly. That when they see you, you are still beautiful. You have to. Don't let yourself go and the narcissist see you down and out. Because he already talking about you. He have to. To make himself look good to the new supply. Remember, we was the new supply. What he do? Talked about his ex. And get this, guys. Don't um feel no type of way when you see... The narcissist, because it's not ours, the narcissist with someone who look like a puppy with a wig. A narcissist has no preference. So if that puppy with a wig going to give him the time of day, he going to go with it. That's the attention. He just wants attention. He has no preference of a person. He doesn't. She doesn't. My last post I posted and was telling you guys to go watch this video of this bishop who was saying he married this young lady. Did anybody see it? Please comment. Please like and share these videos, God, guys, because um, people hit me up. We are helping so many people. So basically what he was saying was this lady basically was making him lose his mind. It was draining him mentally, physically, emotionally, and financially. He said it got so bad, for those of you that did not see the video, that he tried to commit suicide. He was in the hospital, and his wife came up there and said, Oh, I just came to see if he was dead or alive. I still don't want you, and walked out. People, when I say this bishop the other day was telling his story and was going off, he was like, I'm stepping down, because I guess he was cursing and was so irate. He said, yeah, I'm stepping down, because this is how I feel. That bleep, 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 bleep. I, put, I 
looked at him and said, oh yeah, I know that anger. I know being that upset with the narcissist. And it doesn't matter how you try to diffuse an argument that you see coming. Baby, is something about that demonic spirit that take you there no matter how hard you try to defuse it. I used to be like, babe, please fight. Babe, you can't let it. Babe, don't do this. Babe, come on. And then the next thing you know, I was like, bleep, 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 bleep. They will take you all the way there. And then look at you and go, you crazy. I'm telling you, I prayed for that man of God, yo. I never, do y'all understand me? I don't think there's a word, never suffice right now. But I absolutely cannot go through that. No more I don't want no narcissistic friends. Uh, it's a spirit. And they cannot be trusted. So guys, the narcissist got to talk about you to the new supply because you fly. To make the new supply want to stay with him or her. So with your fly self, just know you being talked about. Some things, he's just going above and beyond. Oh, but don't get this. All the time is not good. The narcissist got to make you look bad to his family, his friends, um, because you was fly when you came. So people automatically want to know what happened. A narcissist will never tell the truth. And it's always going to be your fault. Always. Oh, she this. Oh, he this. Oh, I, w I was trying to do this, and she kept doing this, and he kept, oh, yeah, baby, you hang it up. And, and the crazy thing is, his family and friends really know how he is. But why do you think when they come and tell a lie, and they already know how he is or she is, they believe them. I told you it was times that I told the narcissist sister things that she said she heard before but yet and still she would question my integrity one time she said are you telling me all this to expose him or are you really concerned wow 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 Guys, let me tell you something. Thank the Lord above you free. Thank, I'm telling you, this bishop, and granted, guys, he don't know the label to put on the lady that he was dealing with. He don't know that was a narcissistic spirit. However, he do know it wasn't normal. But he did not know that he was dealing with a narcissist. And the bishop said that other bishops that dealt with her almost made them lose their mind. Now, these are men of the cloth preaching strong. And little old her, that spirit that they did not see, almost made them lose their mind. So much so, he said... People told me to stay away from her. He said, one bishop said, I was going to kill her. Guys, we don't want nothing. And that's what it is. Nothing. That spirit is nothing to try to come. Because it was something that they needed from us spiritually, mentally, and emotionally that they never can get, never can have. And they always camouflage to the person that they're with. If you go back and look at the, the, the previous videos, 
they became us. So it's not like we fell in love with them. Guys, we fell in love with ourselves through them because they became us. So we fell in love with us. Guys, I just wanted to share that for the people that are still struggling, guys. Those of us who have got up and got out, um, let's lift them up in prayer. We don't have to know them personally. But something as simple as, God, anybody that is going through this mental and emotional torture, free them. The narcissist is not getting away, guys. There is nothing that you can do to get back at them. Allow God to do it. Oh, and I don't care how many years it's been. I don't care how many years you've been gone. The narcissist always try to come back to old supply. I'm telling you, always going to try to come back. Gird yourself up. Build yourself up in the word and prayer. I'm telling you, people, look at some of the testimonies on um the posts on my YouTube channel of people that have been out for years and the narcissist still trying to come back. I had a young lady tell me yesterday. All of a sudden, her ex-husband has been hitting her up for like six months straight after being gone for seven years. Yeah. I love you guys. Have a fantabulous day. Remember, today is a good day to have a great day. Thank you.